turning out to be the most epic game I've ever seen. I'm going to start casting, playing on Towcross and casting more Towcross. Yeah, and Straylock is bluffed by the Zerg Queens on landing this command center, and I'm not going to miss this either. I missed half of it, but whatever. A swarm goes off. A swarm went off on the bridge, and that stopped that pretty nicely, pretty beautifully. And these fire bats do splash damage to the lurkers. So they are able to take it out before they lose their lives. Breathe, soul. But these lurker eggs are going to hatch just in time. The timing, the timing. This is a perfect point. The swarm with two swarms here and here. And then just kind of lurker that point up, and then the Terran can't do anything right there. Yeah, <coughs> yeah. Okay, that would be pretty cool. But I don't think um, what the space had any um, swarms or defilers for that matter. So now Maw Dragon is off two base compared to Straylock's one. Trying to get the second base. Yeah, it's gonna be two base in about ten seconds with an SCV transfer. And that is not the position Maw Dragon needs to be at because. Ooh, Straylock is still behind him, and from some beautiful swarms, Straylock has stayed behind Mondragon in the side count. And, oh my god, we might go this three parts, this might be four parts, and then my massive ass files will take three hours to download. I can't, I don't know how to compress them yet, I haven't found anything good that, that I want to use to compress. I might use virtual dub right now, but then the audio might screw itself up, and I'm not talking about that right now. I'm thinking out loud. That's what I'm doing. Straylock is coming down to this 6 o'clock-ish, 7 o'clock-ish location, and he's going to lay siege to it. But Mon Dragon, not wanting to lose it, sunk into the place up. But I don't think it's going to be in time. He needs to come and flank this force, and that'll be GG if he can take this out. The Overlord's going to get taken out and breathe soul. Okay, Swarm moves off on the Marines, and this entire force is going to get um, eaten up by Mondragon, and this is bad for Straylock. He might have just lost this game by a beautiful Swarm and Breathe Soul. <gasps> a swarm goes needs a plague on that, and this force is going to get cleaned up again. This is horrible for Straylock, and boom, 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 boom. That entire thing gets cleaned up, and this is bad for Straylock. He's at 83 side count, and now Mondragon's at 118. That's the lowest Straylock's been all game for a while. And Swarm's right here, and I missed a drop C. I don't feel special anymore. Swarm did get cleaned up, though, because of a Swarm on the drones. Drop did get cleaned up because of a Swarm on the drones. And talk normally, soul. Yeah, so that's what happened. Swarm on the drones. I go drone. And that saved the drones' lives, and Straylock just kind of flew away. And that is what's going down. Oh, my God. This is why Tau Cross is imbalanced as well. The dumbass siege tank on the... Ridge can take out that gas, and that's crucial for Zerg. And he needs to bring his Mutalisks, but I'm not going to miss this. I feel like Jesus takes out, loses those units. But this Lurker is not burrowing, because I'm pretty sure Mondragon was focusing on this and just kind of staring at it, going, oh, no. Another expansion is going down for Mondragon here at, at this main base. So he's going to try and get the stay at the two base, two gas. Okay, one gas. Because these gas are depleted, dead, screwed. But Straylock is off two base as well. And I don't know who has... Yeah, Mon Dragon, if you see he has less gas than he would like. But so is Straylock at 69. Where is Mon Dragon? 186 gas. Mon Dragon does hold this off. And we might go to a 40 minute game. And that would be... We could go to a 50 minute game. And that would be the longest game in the history of Earth. Storm goes off. And... This force is going to be eaten up by Mondragon's perfect swarms that have been occurring lately. And the Defiler gets a swarm up. That's the difference between higher level players and not higher level players. The Defilers always get something off before the, they pop from a Radiates. And this is bad for Straylock. He's pretty much cornered in two ways. This little attack force got cleaned up by a Radiates, though. Which is why Straylock needed the plague. He needed to take out the science vessels. And that is another science vessel that gets sniped. And these Hydralisks are doing the job of a hero Mutalisk. And I'm looking at the main map, not missing anything. Good. The gas is keeps getting shelled. And that's huge tank as being a bimbo. But that's all I have to say. And I just got a headache. Need to breathe. Must remember to breathe sometimes. But here we go. Straylock is going to be able to... Is going to be stopped cold. This little... Okay, the Zerglings are going to be stopped cold. I have to run to the support of their sunken colonies. And Defiler and Lurker and Zerglings. <sighs> And here we go, here comes the fun stuff. The Marines are going to have to turn away and go to this expansion, which is very lightly defended, and Straylock might just be able to take it out, and I'm giving myself a headache from my voice, which is sometimes annoying to even me. Oh, that hurt. 